So hey, I'm going to be teaching another trick today, and it's laying down, and I'm doing it for Christine. I love Winston 28. Pretty much. So, I'm using Surprise. She's actually only lied down. So she's never actually been able to lie down. Like she, I've got her to lie down a couple times when she was about three months old. And then I kind of got her to fall over, which is not okay, when she was like eight months old. And that didn't do anything. Later this summer, I kind of got her to lie down once, but she didn't like that, so she's never done it again. And I've never been able to get her to lie down after that. So I actually just was messing around today because I thought of a, something that could actually help. And so I am like, because a lot of people, they like to tie up the hoof and then wrap the, the rope around their body. So when the horse kicks, they can kick themselves and scratch themselves up. So I figured out a way where you can still tie the rope around, but if they kick around, then they won't be able to hurt themselves, pretty much. Um, so, yeah. I will show you this trick. And you might want two lead ropes. I did it with one just because the other one I have is crappy. That's down here with me right now. And I just kind of did on the last second, like, oh, I'm going to try teaching her to lie down. Because I've been trying to get her to lie down and she just won't do it. So I don't like the idea of ropes, but. I've tried multiple ways and they just don't seem to work for some horses. Some. So far mine. Because I'm trying to, I'm teaching Whoopi to lie down without the rope. So Annie! Shh. Shh. Go away. So here I go. Let's do this. Okay, so basically it's it's a lot easier if your horse can already bow because then they can get down and then they're obviously not getting the release so they start thinking what am I doing wrong so they start trying things out and then they're on the ground and they're like oh wait I was supposed to do that it was that easy so so I'll just show her lying down right now and she's only two and a half years old so she's not very old It's nice if you teach them to get up when you say up when you're lying down. So if you want, if your horse can't bow, you can just ask and I'll make a tutorial on how to teach a horse to bow. I'll just make a tutorial on how to teach your horse to bow too. I'm kind of doing this out of order, like usually laying down is like the last trick because I like to do um, the easy tricks to the harder tricks so they learn how to learn tricks. But Christine really wanted to wanted me to make a tutorial on how to teach horse lie down. And she's really nice to me, so I'm just like, yeah, she deserves it. Okay, so pretty much. I'm gonna get my rope. And I'm gonna Use this end, like this, and I'm just going to tie, no, I want to make it bigger, I want to make it bigger, I'm going to tie, so their foot can go in there, see it can't tighten on their foot, and it just kind of holds their foot, and if they're struggling too much, their foot will eventually come out of there. So I hope that she doesn't get out of the camera. Like I said, she's already done it today. Good. Okay. So you're gonna pick up their foot and put their foot through the loop. Put your head up. And when you tie it, now when you tie it, you're going to bring it around the back like this. People like to bring it under here, under their stomach, but that's what causes the foot to pull back here. So when they start kicking, they start kicking themselves in the other leg. And I've actually 
seen a horse get cut up doing that. So bring it over the back this way. So when they start kicking, it, the only way it can really go is outwards, but it just it just really can't go anywhere. So you're gonna grab the other end where you're holding it like this. Okay? And you're just gonna hold this rope. Now, this is when it's nice to have the other lead rope so you can tie it onto their head, but I'm just gonna grab her halter and just keep things down. And she'll go into her bow, down, down. She might jump around a bit, down, 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 down. Oh, and usually, what'd you do, huh? Did you get stuck, huh? Good girl. I'll just keep her there. So that was kind of a rough down. She usually, a lot of them will lie down the first time that way, but actually her first lie down today, she went down nicely, like into a bow, then rolled herself back to a lie down. But really, the first time it only took not even five minutes. Um, it could be because she has lied down a couple times. But also with Jenny Lynn, it only took about a couple minutes. Um, but I did, taught Jenny Lynn a different way. But it's a lot nicer if your horse can bow first. So if you want me to make a tutorial, then I will. But yeah, teach your horse to lie down.